I don't think people understand how game theory shapes our world. From Cold War nukes to Netflix recommendations, game theory shapes everything. Master it, and you'll always be one step ahead. Let's start with Nash Equilibrium. This concept is where no player can benefit by changing their strategy while the other players keep theirs unchanged. It's significant because it explains why people stick to certain strategies even if they're not the best overall. Works in business and roommate drama. Burn your ships, like signing a gym contract to force yourself to go. Now let's dive deeper into one of the most iconic examples of game theory, the prisoner's dilemma. This fundamental problem shows why two rational individuals might not cooperate, even when it's in their best interest. Picture this. Two criminals are arrested and interrogated separately. They face a tough choice. Betray each other by testifying or cooperate by staying silent. If both betray, they each serve two years in prison. If one betrays while the other stays silent, the betrayer goes free and the silent one serves three years. If both stay silent, they only serve one year each. The dilemma? Each prisoner must decide without knowing the other's choice, leading to a scenario where betrayal often seems the safer bet. But here's the kicker. The seemingly rational choice of betrayal results in a worse outcome for both. This isn't just a theoretical exercise. The prisoner's dilemma plays out in real-life situations like business negotiations, environmental policies, and even everyday decisions like whether to share your Netflix password. Understanding this can help you navigate complex social dynamics and make better strategic choices. So next time you're in a tricky spot, remember the prisoner's dilemma and consider how cooperation might just be the smarter move. Comment below if you've ever used game theory in real life and don't forget to subscribe for more insights on how math affects you IRL and remember math isn't magic, it's everywhere.